Okay, so anyway, I'm going for viewing now. Okay, I'm selling this unit uh, in Sengkang. Okay, I won't actually review like which unit is it or which uh, address is it. Okay, so basically, I just want to share with you for the past few months, I would say two to three months till today. Uh, um, my HDB uh, sale has been pretty good. Okay, so what I mean by pretty good is not that we sell a lot and all these things. Pretty good meaning that uh, a lot of the HDB units, right? Are selling off very fast so basically uh, I can feel the hit from like 2013 2009 that kind of hit okay so you can uh, leave a comment below okay let me know uh, what is your thoughts about it okay so basically I will share with you my point of view from here okay so basically my point of view is a bit special because uh, um, what happened is that uh, recently I have sold a lot of HDB some even in one day some in like uh two days okay some in uh maybe one or two weeks okay so why i did why i use the word days is because uh, i may just have only one viewing as in like one day so that one day maybe within that one hour time frame i open up to maybe like uh, five to ten groups and i managed to sell the unit away so that's what i mean okay okay i don't like to use like uh, marketing gimmicks to make you think that hey, I can sell very fast and all these things but I am pretty confident with my sales technique as well as my marketing my photos and a lot of my strategies that I've been using for the past few years and it has always always been very successful okay but that's not the point okay the point is even if all these things are done right right in the past uh, maybe last year or the year before a lot of units are uh, takes uh, uh, two months three months four months okay maybe i'll say a uh, couple of viewings maybe up to maybe like 10 20 viewings but last time a bit different you know last time is like every viewing you only have like one or two buyers so one week you may only have like one or two viewings okay but what happened okay i'm talking about hdb uh, let me remind you i'm talking about hdb sale but what happened recently is that every single advertisement that i put up for hdb right i get many 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 calls okay so the the table has tilt because when i get many many calls right i will know that the demand is there so when i know that the demand is there it gives me a uh, more um i would say a uh, upper hand in order to get a better price for my customer as well as a uh, um, uh, upper hand in terms of negotiation because every viewing right uh, even though I am actually like allocating time slot meaning that at every one time I only have five people in the house I still able to get many groups to come on the same day consecutively so like one after another so basically it, it gives me a lot of upper hand as a selling agent to be able to negotiate better as well as there's demand so that uh, we can actually uh, show the other buyers that, that this unit don't only have just one buyer coming it's very different because for the past few years right uh, viewings has been one or two groups then one week maybe one or two times but today right view we get calls almost every day and every day we get five to six calls for HDB selling okay I'm not too sure is it for every HDB selling but I have done from Sengkang to Chua Chu Kang uh, to Bishan and a lot of areas and it has be seen that way okay but most of the units that i'm selling now are uh, to be frank they are all around the 20 over years mark so uh i only sell one that is around uh there's a couple of units at 30 over 30 years plus minus but it's not those units right that has passed 39 years old okay so if you know the hdb ruling well the cpf withdrawal ruling well right there's this withdrawal uh limit that uh, if the property age is below a certain age to the buyer then they cannot use CPF okay so basically I just want to share with you most of the units that I'm saying now that I'm selling doesn't fall into that category okay so maybe because it doesn't fall into that category so it's performing better in in terms of like the wholesale feedback as well as the demand okay so what am I sharing with you is that because you see there's a lot of people calling so when there's a lot of uh, people demanding and asking for viewing as an agent, we cannot um, just like take every single time slot. Like maybe or oh, Tuesday got three o'clock someone, then Wednesday four o'clock. Wow, then we will be crazy. You know the owner also will be crazy. So we have to uh, start the open house concept. 
open house concept meaning that of course not not the uh, that a lot of people think that open house concept is that you open your house then people just walk in and walk in okay we don't do that in this covid situation okay and as well as nowadays i can tell you that open house concept doesn't work because people don't just walk in like that so basically what we do is we set a time frame and then we set appointments after appointments consecutively then at every point we'll do safe entry and at every point we'll allow like maximum five people in the house so people will queue up to actually enter the house to view the house so we will set a specific scheduled uh, viewing time okay uh, one on the weekday one on the weekend okay so the feedback has been really really good for a lot of H HDB like I told you uh, I have already sold a couple in just one time slot just one time slot okay so we're not going for like a few time slot just one time slot so basically this is uh what is going on in the market and this thing hasn't cooled off because uh today is already end october by right you should start cooling off but we haven't cooled off so i'm also expecting to see the changes which you watched in my last video the changes that will happen in the november and the december so i'm pretty sure this won't cool off but um i feel that this is a very uh, special occurrence like why are everyone rushing to buy a house you know uh, regardless whether is it hdb or private i will touch on the private uh, sale the next time round, but re re regardless of whether HDB or private that is a lot of people coming to buy okay so uh, my thoughts are because a lot of people are working from home people are spending more time at home so maybe their expectation of their house right is getting higher and uh, maybe uh, some people that are staying with their parents they feel that hey I want to work from home it's very uh, it's too small it's not uh, conducive enough so people are moving ahead right to satisfy more needs and wants in terms of their housing okay so this is just my personal feeling and also I feel that because in these pandemic moments right people are trying to buy before the pandemic ends so many people are predicting that when this COVID is better and is is improving right the market will start to move so it seems like this is a this is a kickstart uh, impact or kickstart effect but uh, how whether how, whether it will sustain all the way to the end of the COVID or maybe end of next year I wouldn't know so I will continue to keep you guys updated so this is what happening now so I'm going for the viewing so hopefully this unit will also get a one day uh, sell off you know I wouldn't know but there's a lot of viewings but we are doing it on the Wednesday 7 o'clock time slot so uh, some people may be still working and all these things so we will do one more on the weekend so the weekend one will be the more amazing one so most of the time the weekend viewing is very very amazing there will be a lot of people coming I mean for now using my marketing techniques lah. but the amazing thing is for today right I have like more than five groups coming on the weekday evening okay so that's it for today's video stay tuned you will see more uh, uh, videos that is being done in the car because it's soundproof and I don't really like to carry my camera and walk around and, and talk so much for property because it's a very, very sensitive topic and also to respect my customer I don't do it in their house also lah. and I won't film their house or their 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 face or, or the bias that's coming in so I will show you such footage okay so uh, because my footage are very real you know I don't try to portrait something like that and film okay okay so that's it for today's video um for the members right i'm still going to talk about link q or i don't know how you pronounce it but there's this beauty world condo i'm really really cracking my brains on what i can say and what i cannot say and what i should say and what is what is the important point because there's too many points to it and and i will say that this prop this project is so 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 subjective okay it's it's uh it's really a it's really a point whereby it actually will portray to you how District 21 will become next time. It's either like that or like that. It's very extreme ends. Okay, so that's it for today's video. Hit the like button, subscribe button, and I'll see you in the next episode. Bye!